train. The orphans! Job. That's Mr. Evil Dr. Porkchop to you. And I've got a score to settle with you, Sheriff Woody. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bullseye! And so the evil Dr. Porkchop was defeated, and the orphan train made it safely to its destination. Wait a sec. You had a giant pig ship and a fleet of attack drones, and you lost to a cowboy on a horse? Hey, the iPad severely hampered my depth perception. Oh, right. Blame the iPad. Anyway, back to the game board. Which, if I can say, is seriously impressive. I cannot believe you built this. Yeah, well, I wanted to create a map that featured all of the significant landmarks we encountered on our exciting journey here. Hey! What's next? Should we go to Andy's uh, house? Watch it, Rex! Just knocked Al's toy barn into the pond! Oh, sorry! Uh, I'm sorry! Oh, oh, I'm oh, gonna oh, have to oh, reset oh, the whole town! Oh, oh, uh, pardon me? Oh, what's this area again? Hey, good eye, my prickly friend! That is a special part of the game called Woody's Roundup! You can roam free, upholding justice as a sheriff in the Old West. Cool. We can go there? Really? Let's go. Only if a certain lizard brain promises not to stomp it to smithereens. I probably won't. I promise. <laughs> I sent Rex to the basement to get the cordless phone. So now we just need to find Andy's cell phone. Then, when we call it... Andy will find us with the phone and play with us one last time. I like it, cowboy! Yee-haw! Great! We got the cell phone. Now, we just need to call it from the home phone. Rex is still MIA. And hasn't brought back the cordless phone. We better see what's keeping him. Come on! Get it down. Sir, I believe we can help. My men are deployed throughout the room, but tied up at the moment. If you can free them, they'll get that phone down safely. Guaranteed. Thanks, Sarge. Good work. Get that phone to Andy's room. We'll find Rex and catch up with you there. Yes, sir. You heard him, men. Move, move, move! Around here somewhere, sir. Rex, you were supposed to get the phone and come right back. No! The most light year game! <laughs> we haven't played this in years! Yeah, I made it to the Gamma Quadrant! I'm almost to Zerg's Fortress! Guys, come on! We need to get back! Oh. Rex, we know you can defeat him! Just do it quickly!
Buzz, are you there? I'm through the meteor shower. <laughs> so, we meet again, Buzz Lightyear, for the last time. together to save ourselves and got back home safe and sound. Then Andy entrusted us to Bonnie, which is how we got here. Any questions? Yeah. What about Bonnie's story of the haunted bakery? Yeah! You left out one of the best parts! You didn't tell us about the haunted bakery? Haunted bakery? Well, I wanna hear! Me too, me too! Go ahead and tell him, Ham. Okay, okay, settle down. So, what happened is that a quaint little bakery got built right on top of a graveyard. Disgruntled phantoms possess the baked goods. Imagine a land where food eats people. Food eats people? He's on a roll. It was a full moon and the muffins were getting restless. They had already eaten all the townsfolk, but were still hungry for more. No, my precious muffins. You'll pay for that. It was a witch who made the haunted muffin for her wedding day. Oh, uh, yeah. And she's married to evil Dr. Porkchop. And their plan is to force-feed everyone their poisonous wedding cake to put the entire world under mind control. Beautiful day, then, isn't it? Then, suddenly, a giant space cannon fell from the sky. Wow, Bonnie. You have a great imagination. 